welcome to Douglas Reviews. Today I'll be talking about the game Disney's Illusion Island. Mickey and his friends got this map that appears to be drawn by a six-year-old. Turns out the um, hamster-like creatures, the Hokans, gave them the map. Mickey and his friends decide to check out the mysterious tune emanating from an island. And this is where the adventure starts. Oh, and don't forget the mailboxes are very useful in a game. Every time you die, you return to the checkpoint, the mailbox. The pros, learning new skills from Maisie, exploring and finding new areas that require new skills. Once I watched a walkthrough, I played through the rest of the game just fine. The cons, first time playing was confusing. It made it hard to figure out where to go next and I got lost on my first playthrough. I had to start a fresh game and watch a walkthrough by Beard Bear just to get going. I think fast travel should be an option from the start. The pink ocean like ooze looks like it was on borrowed from a Kirby game. Let me tell you about the art style. It was fun, it looks cute, according to D. Lala Studios. The story got a little complex about who stole the um, tomes and why but overall the story was brilliant it was um taught yet fun let me tell you about music it was brilliant it was creative it was like a world of fantasy and world adventure which i enjoyed and loved the overall it was fun it was brilliant fantasy game i give disney's illusion island a 10 out of 10.